all the anomalies that come with CERN, all the questions, all the secrets, and all the money poured into these experiments that go on in places like Fermilabs and CERN, well, they're about to be outdone by China, if China has its way, in constructing a next generation 100 kilometer collider that's going to dwarf CERN or CERN's Large Haldron Collider. And this is all to study the Higgs boson or the God particle. And they are dubbing this a next generation 100 kilometer proton proton circular electron positron collider that will dwarf the European facility. Now, they're saying it's designed to fire protons at near light speed and to smash them together to mass produce the transient God particle for intensive study. And as of right now, scientists would say that the Higgs boson presents the ultimate frontier in particle physics. They're saying that the significance of the elementary particle and its properties is that it's able to be examined using existing knowledge and experimental technology as a means to confirm and study the entire Higgs field theory. But in layman's terms, it's basically saying that different subatomic particles are responsible for giving different matter different properties. And one of the most mysterious and important properties is mass. And then, of course, we have dark mass or dark matter. Now, some particles like protons in neutrons, they have mass, while others, like photons, do not. So the Higgs boson is believed to be the particle which gives mass to matter, according to scientists. So this is all going into that field, and I've talked about how they've had studies in the past where they had straight up stated that they wanted to try to take the next dimension, the fourth dimension, and fold it in on the third in an experiment. And whatever they do next, I will definitely update on. But this is the latest in terms of what China is looking to achieve here. If they're successful, this thing will be absolutely massive. It would then be the largest known collider on Earth. And I just got a funny feeling. There's one hidden underground somewhere anyway that's absolutely massive. If there's not already one that's 100 kilometers large in size, well, China set to be the first ones to do it so heads up i'll leave a link follow me on twitter for more this has been dabu7 much love y'all